one summer, when I was attending a boys camp, I got to go on a five-day fishing trip to an island in the Susquehanna River. It was a lot of fun. Getting to and from the island, on the other hand, that was another story. It wasn't a very big island and there was no bridge, so we paddled out to the island using canoes. Each canoe had a couple campers in it, as well as a leader in the back of the canoe. Canoeing didn't make any sense to me. If you're out for a drive in a car, the person in front is in charge and they know what's going on. Anytime I rode a bus, the person in charge who knew where we were going was out in front. Even if you're out for a hike, the person who knows where you're going leads from the front. Why would the person who knows what's going on, who knows what's happening, be sitting all the way in the back? It takes a lot of trust to be seated in front of the person who's in control. I couldn't see what they were doing. I could only see the things ahead of me, some of which scared me. But I learned that it's easy to control and steer a canoe from that position. My walk with Jesus is like that. I have mixed emotions about a passage from Isaiah 30. Verse 21 says, whether you turn to the right or to the left, your ears will hear a voice behind you saying, this is the way, walk in it. It's comforting, even exciting to know that God directs us as we go through life. But I would rather that verse said, whether you turn to the right or to the left, you will see me in front of you and hear me saying, this is the way, you're walking in it. But that wouldn't take much faith, would it? Do you trust God to direct your life? Are you walking by faith?